have no idea why there's cops on ba about every block around here. That's at least 10 cop cars I've seen. Huh. So, time for another video that's just another in this streak of videos about the Occupy Together movement that is going to destroy my channel by turning it into a cross between uh, Survivor and Cops. Some kind of twisted reality TV show. Um, today, we're going to tell you the story of Monkey Boy. This is a tale about why you shouldn't jump to the conclusion right away that someone is just a douchebag. Now see, we've got douchebags that visit the protest area all the time. Mr. Clean, for instance, and we we have a nickname for him too. Um, and when he brings buckets of water to throw on the sidewalk chalk and then uses a broom to scrub it right in front of the protesters, we know he's just trying to incite violence and be a douchebag. But there are other people who, you know, they go beyond disagreement with their anger, but they're not, at, at the core of their heart, really douchebags. They, they seem very angry, but if you get to know some of their, their inner workings by talking to them, um, you start to feel uh, a real sadness. And in a town like Colorado Springs that is surrounded by four different military bases, you, you kind of get a feel for what PTSD looks like. And uh, when you run into a drunken soldier or a drunken veteran who is on one of their tears, um, you know, it, it's not something to laugh at in, in that moment, but, but you just, you get dismissive of their anger because, you know, they, they don't really uh, mean you any harm by what they're doing. It's, it's just, you know, it's a, a side effect of having soldiers living around you that have been through so many tours of so many different foreign countries. Um, and some of them have seen a lot of action and it messed them up. So, um, when you can tell that that's where they're coming from, you, you kind of give them a little bit more leeway. And that's what we did um, in the footage that you're about to see of Monkey Boy. Um, he, you know, he can really try to push some buttons, but uh, knowing where he's coming from, no one really thinks that he is that douchebag that Mr. Clean is. Um, so... Here's what happened. It's not on us. our side. It's not us. You guys are you're fighting on your side. You're fighting the wrong 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 side. Yeah, there's people out here who care. They're the ones who Who the fuck do you know who died of this? Name. My dad did 20 on me. What's your name? Michael Dern. I was born on base for a Oh, dude, 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 dude. Fuck, fuck. Is he dead? It's okay. I lost my father 22 years ago. He did not you just said he was in Fort Carson. No, I was born on base in Fort no, Carson. No, 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 no. You he just can't. told me he was on he Fort can't. Carson. He died 22 years ago. Fort Carson wasn't there 22 years ago. So you told but me. But it was. Because <laughs> I was born. I was born while my dad was in the military. Yeah. So Either probably. way. He's fucking lying. I'm wrong here. I'm 28 years old. Okay. So guess what? When I was born, what does that matter? Hey, Charles Kapir. Evans Army Hospital. What does that matter? Ago, if you have internet access, you can Google it. I want anybody here who has fucking served a fucking Say minute. Something. A minute. Say something. A minute Do in combat. Something. Yeah. Raise Shut your up. fucking hand. Yeah, you yeah. Yeah. What unit were you with? No, first meal. 31st meal. Oh, Where? God. When? That wasn't a combat tour. Oh. You lose Iraq when? We really don't know. Right. What year? Yeah. 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 over here. Yeah. Yeah. He's got something to show you right there. Take a look at that. See that? that? Fucking scale when you take three I'm bullshitting. From where? From, From where? From where? Full scale. What From unit? George Bush. You're full of shit. You're full of shit. 101st Airborne. Why are you so angry? Look, we're willing to listen. Why am I so angry? Why am I so angry? Why am I so angry? 
Get off the table. Not being angry on that one. Why am I angry? Why am I angry? Wait. Why am I angry? Why are you angry? Because I fucking served, dude. I've done fucking for what? For our rights, correct? You don't have to agree. It's not about our fucking. Don't call me Shug. And it's not about our first fucking amendment. It's about signing. What are you doing when you join the army? What are you signing? What are you signing? When you fucking join the army, what do you say? What do you do? You also signed that you're in complete so compliance with the government also what? and that you serve okay. the fucking American people. It's a document that's set in stone. You are fucking open to a document that's stone It is. on paper. Either way, you guys are a bunch of fucking bitches. Get a job. Cool. I have a job. You're a drunken monkey. I'm a correction officer. Correction officer? Where? Where? CJC. CJC. Colorado yeah. Springs. Obviously. Uh, I'm a dependent. My yeah. father was 20 years army. I was born. You need to fucking get a life, dude. You need to get sober. Who the hell are you to tell me to get a life? You're a drunken monkey, dude. You don't know me. You don't know me. You have no legitimacy here. You don't know me. I'm not a fucking monkey anymore, dude. Take. Now, at this point, I really have to give Monkey Boy some credit because um, I'd have to think really hard to try to imagine something more psychologically terrifying than someone angrily taking off their monkey suit at you. Seriously. Come on, I'm telling you. What my ass, dude. What my fucking ass. Because I guarantee you. You don't even know what you're getting into, dude. You have no fucking clue who you're talking to. I guarantee you'll be in jail. Let's get the fuck out of here. I guarantee I won't. I'll stand here just like this. Let's go, motherfucker. That's right. Get it on, dude. Let's go. Hit me. Fuck you. I'm not going to stoop down to your level. Exactly. You guys are all a bunch of fucking faggot bitches who won't do shit. You guys have a fucking shit. You won't preach what you want fucking want. You, none of you know what the fuck you really want. I know what the fuck I really want. Oh, great. Call the cops when you're drunk. Call the cops! Oh my god! Guess wow, what? what a drunken monkey, dude. If the cop comes, I'm just gonna show the cop this display. Yeah, like, look, right, look right there. This guy is you know, made a dick. dick. He's so incoherent and drunk, he doesn't realize. Dude, he's a drunken he's fucking him. monkey. <laughs> like. And after going down to the corner to scream for some police for I don't know what, um, Monkey Boy returned and he wanted to know what part of the system we were fighting against. A system, system? That, the system that is supposed to be in place. See, Which is? System that is democracy? A representative yes, democracy. It is. It is. But they are not representative. It's you want to They do not represent us. Prove it. It is. You can look at the statistics. <laughs> How old are you? I'm 19. Dude, you haven't oh, even I'm got young, your fucking I'm dumb. Dick I get it. You don't even know what the fuck you're talking about. Really? Okay. Cool. If this is the new get, generation, if I can, if I can sit here, your fucking ass. if I'm if I'm as dumb, new generation, my dude, fucking ass. If I'm as dumb, I was a new fucking generation. Get out of my face, when I know, fuck you. Yeah, get out of my face, bitch. Know, I know, I know, fuck you, you fucking stop know, spitting in my face. Pussy ass, motherfucking faggot, faggot, fuck, pussy bitch, motherfucker. I'm a fucking pussy. Can you do it? So yeah, at this point, I started to feel bits of spittle hitting my arm and I swear they tingled like mouthwash or aftershave you know like little uh, you know out of here this is America a anger, I don't give a fuck anger anger, anger. 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 arrest this motherfucking guy calm down calm down calm down dude calm down calm down dude calm down, dude. Calm down. Hey, um, no. Seriously, you no. have to calm down. The cops are hey. here. That puts a bad name on you. Show wow. you're totally fine. I don't like when people get in my fucking I face I like that. You did a good job on the video. Thank you. Yeah. yeah. Just watch the video. At this point, there's a break in the footage because I was showing the police officer the footage of what just happened because we didn't call the police. They could hear Monkey Boy yelling at us. And so... Uh, they were just down the street, and they came. And uh, when the police officer asked uh, if uh, everyone was okay, you know, we were saying, yeah, just, if you can just get them out of here, nobody really wants to have a problem, you know, we can squash this, because 
really no one wants to see someone who's suffering like that um, have anything bad happen to them, you know. I know uh, Dakota. I've been uh, Dakota's. Really? Oh, I got a cousin who is a Yeah. Thank you. Like, yeah. Yeah. And it's hard for me to determine like, really yeah. who's at fault, but if he's all, all it takes primary is a aggressor, that, I mean, then at least for a little while. If anything, what I've learned from you know, the street. All right. Okay, though. I can, I can tell you for stuff, but thanks for coming in. Okay. Everyone else staying all right? Yeah, okay. You're all right, man. Okay. All right, thank you, thank you. Thank you, I'll just have a good night, okay? No, I'm sorry, right? Thank you very much. What was your name again? Michael. Rob, you take care of me. Thanks, I'll see you around. Okay, be safe out there. I will. I think it's like taking the <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay. Good. Were you guys yelling or anything? Or just, no, just not yelling. yelling. Just loving life. All right. All right. All right. All right. You can blow us. Yo, come to my car. I'm going to give you my hand. I just kind of blessed that. I love flesh. Oh, Out. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Come, okay. I'm serious. These guys can't. This. You guys have to be careful. You have to protect yourselves. You need a chair. No, you do. You have to protect yourself. So these guys that come back, let me tell you, I'm serious. You're supposed to do that, but in this situation, don't. You know how detrimental that is to oh, not oh be God. violent. Don't. Of course. He's getting a breathalyzer. He's probably gonna go to prison. Or I'm sorry, he's jail. probably gonna go to jail. He's gonna get. He might be released after he's sober or whatever. Might get but some help. I can handle being pushed help. around by some bobbies, but that guy fucking pisses me off. Yeah, of course. Why not? Hey, man. That's what they do. This is kitchen oh, over This is all these impressions making me they hungry, actually brother. Send. Hey, is everyone all right here? Yeah. Okay. Uh, we're going to be getting him out of here, okay? Okay. Thank okay. Thank you Thank very you. much. We appreciate it. Dude, come on. Hi. I'm up here. I can say ten. Look at this shit. Look at this. Dude, seriously, I love you all, but, like, my eyes are up here. My eyes are up here. Look me in the eyes. I love you guys. Wait, wait. Is, have somebody been... Has somebody been checking you out? I love you guys. <laughs> hey, check it out. Pay your taxes, goddammit. Pay your fucking taxes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. I, I know I creeped you out. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> if he's doing that, it's totally on camera. And he's telling me to punch him. <laughs> I'll do it. <laughs> no, the officer just told me I can't. <laughs> because you guys have had such good rapport with your police officers, you do not want Yeah, it's true. Do you guys have a good phone with you? Yeah. I wish I did. He said that he's getting a ride, so we should be out here any second. But if he makes a scene again, call us right away. Because, uh, yeah. I mean, there's guys here and stuff, but he was in life. It is, can be... Oh, we saw him. Have you seen Well, this one. night tonight with Halloween coming can be... Yeah. yeah, people in monkey suits. <laughs> That's not the worst. Yeah. Yeah. You. you guys stay warm, okay? okay. Yeah. Yeah. And so, uh, to end this video, I just want to say hats off to Polly. Um, he was sitting right next to me, but uh, he's only 19 years old, and uh, that was a tremendous amount of restraint that he showed. Um, it, I think maybe it's a little bit easier for some of us who are veterans who actually have a part of us like that and know that um, we were that close to becoming that. Um, but uh, Polly's a good kid.